Hi, I'm Phil, the My Way Chef. Today, I'm gonna to be sharing with you my most favorite chicken recipe, breaded chicken cutlets. And as a bonus, after I finish that, I'm gonna share with you my favorite chicken parmesan. Keep watching. I have here two chicken breasts that have the tenderloin on them that I'm gonna remove here and use for a later use. And then I'm gonna cut this one pole to pole. So let me get started on that. So first I remove the tenderloin. And I take this piece and I cut it pole to pole. And I have two thin pieces of chicken breast. I got the uh, tenderloin here. I'm gonna use this later on. So I'm gonna put it in the freezer, or I might use it for my chicken marcella or even for chicken soup. Now, these are cut thin, but they're not uniform. And for them to cook evenly, they should be fairly uniform. The way I make them uniform is to pound them. And I do so by placing them in a freezer bag that I've cut on both sides here so I could put them one on the bottom and cover it with the other. Then I take my pounder and I pound them. Now, uniform thickness. Now the chicken's been all pounded and it's been brined in sugar and water and it's described in the recipe on how to do it, okay? So first I'm gonna flour it on both sides, okay? I do that by shaking some flour on both sides of the chicken. Then I'm gonna put in this egg wash, which is eggs, water, and oil, my egg wash, okay? Put it in here. Both sides, drain off the excess. Then I'm gonna place it in this combination of breadcrumbs and pecorino and bread it. And then put it up here as I've done the previous one. Chicken is breaded and then we're ready to fry it. I'm gonna put it in this uh, frying pan. The oil should be at 360, which it is. Now, if you don't have an insertion thermometer, you can take a little piece of the breaded mixture and if it fries up real quickly, it's ready. I'm gonna fry it for two minutes on each side, then drain it off, drain off the excess oil on these paper towels and put it in my plate. Okay, let's get it going. I'm gonna time it for two minutes. The two minutes is up, let's turn them over. Oh, now he's gonna go to the ground. And we'll do these up for two minutes. Okay, the two minutes are up. We get them here in the peppy towel. and put them in here in my plate. Beautiful breaded cutlets. You can have these just the way they are. Serve them like that. I love them this way. But I promised you a bonus, and I'm gonna show you now how I do chicken palm. And by the way, it's called chicken palm because everybody calls it that. I don't even use Parmesan. I just use Pecorino. So I have marinara sauce, Pecorino, and whole milk mozzarella. And you put a layer of sauce on top. Just a thin layer. You don't have to do much here. Do it to both of them. 
and that looks pretty already. However, we're gonna sprinkle a little pecorino on it. And then the whole milk mozzarella. And now they're ready to be put in a 350 oven for about 10 to 15 minutes and we'll come back and enjoy them. I can't finish a video without my wife's beautiful flowers here. However, I got some other beautiful things. I told you before, my breaded cutlets, one I'm gonna taste, and the chicken parmesan. So I'm gonna taste the breaded chicken. Mm. That was so delicious. Enjoy, enjoy, Enjoy.